Hello everyone, welcome back. A blue baby run today. Historically, I'm bad at blue baby. Now the main reason for this, uh, should be reasonably obvious, is that we can only take spirit hearts. We can't take uh, red hearts of any description. Not from HP upgrades, not from anything. So, we really, really have to try our damnedest not to get hit. There is a tinted rock here though, which is going to help our progress. We're only going as far as mom's heart, so it is possible to compete, I think. Uh, but knowing, uh, as I do, that I am bad with Blue Baby, I'm not entirely expecting to do fantastically well. Uh, I'm just hoping for the best. You know, as long as we do, as long as I do something I'm happy with within my own parameters, uh, that seems good enough for me. We did get a bomb. I'm going to keep shooting my own poop. Uh, wouldn't you? Okay. <laughs> Was kind of hoping for the only thing that can keep us going. These are the spirit hearts there. Dry Baby could actually help out a lot. We're not going to be able to do Hush under any circumstances, which actually is a, a huge load off my mind. Uh, speaking of huge loads, I should use the poop as often as possible. Because the Hush fight, the Hush floor, will never become accessible. Uh, if you're not going beyond the mom fight, uh, the mom's heart fight uh, as a parameter of the actual challenge. That could be worth trying to get, but mm, who cares, right? Um, the blue uh, dry baby is a pretty decent hush companion because you can so easily hide behind it, take basically no damage from the bullet hell, and on a regular occasion it's going to produce yeah, make a poop on this floor. Good idea. It's gonna it's gonna do damage to the whole floor on a regular occasion. However, we do still need to try to get to boss rush and complete it. And I think that's gonna be my undoing, even if I do okay here. That was a pretty clutch dry baby. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Yeah, that didn't work too well. That little fucking horn dodging around my bombs like it was somehow sentient to my bomb play tactics. Outrageous, I'll be honest. Let's try and get these uh, TNT barrels to an explodable state. There we go. Gives us that bit of extra damage against the haunt. Oh, I accidentally fired twice. Never mind. Just don't get hit. Simple as that. We've already taken a full heart of damage so far. Hopefully we can find a tinted rock. Being an XL floor, it's probably worth doing the exploration. Because XL floors are usually faster than their the two floors that they, they replace, but also we're not going to get the opportunity to do half of the second floor because it's incorporated into this floor. So the box could give us something good. It gave us a spirit heart, so there's an HP upgrade. A lemon party is a decent pill to know about, especially. We might as well take uh, Isaac's head as well. So let's explore a bit more. Careful. <laughs> dodging, uh, my dodging game is get coming back. Oh, of course, the uh, the other reason we need to explore a bit more is we haven't found the second item yet. Which I knew. I knew that. So it's got to be around here somewhere. This is unfortunately a dead end. Dead end uh, big rooms are a bit, um, a bit snide. You know, you, you make... You put a lot of effort, a lot of mental energy into a big room. Especially one like this. Oh, that was good. Yeah. Let's try and get Dry Baby hit as often as possible, I suppose, is going to be uh, the plan here. And look for Tinted Rocks wherever possible, because they're really going to help out. To a degree that I cannot ever... that they can never know. Which is a shame. It would be... I think it's important to tell people and things what they mean to you. And in this run, Tinted Rocks, you're my saviour. You are my everything. Even um, even a, a non-blue heart tinted drop, except for that bloody one yonder, which for some fucking reason decided to be a golden chest, which we could go back for now that we have a couple of keys. In fact, it's possibly worth doing so because oh, well, there's our item room. It's possibly worth doing so simply because we skip a room, we get a free item room, so we can afford to use a key which we would have needed for this item room. Maybe we can't, but I'm going to. Anyway. Two. Room is over. Ah, yeah, chemical peel is a, it's a decent damage upgrade. I 
Don't know whether it actually only applies to half of our shots, whether it only looks like it applies to half of our shots. But we'll come up here, we'll open this. Uh, we've got a bomb and a red heart, which does nothing. I'm going to go and fight the second boss and leave. Now here's a problem. We've only got three spirit hearts, but unfortunately this being an XL floor, there is a deal with the devil. So, well, basically what I'm getting at is, even if we don't get hit by a monstro, we're not necessarily going to be able to take it. We didn't get very lucky on Tinted Drops, there weren't very many, and the ones that we did find didn't help. Uh, which is unfortunate, but it's kind of, it's part of the course of Blue Baby, you can't sell your red HP, you don't have any, and you can't get cheap deals with the devil, they all cost 3 HP. Spirit Hearts, of course. I'm trying to get Dry Baby hit by Monstro without getting myself hit by Monstro, just to speed up the fight. It's over anyway, so unless we get an HP upgrade right now, which we didn't... Krampus? No. <laughs> what? This is a, a dick move. We did actually get an HP upgrade. I didn't realise that Crack Jacks was... Guppy or Mom's Knife? I'm going to take Mom's Knife. I'm going to take Mom's Knife. Uh, what did I just win? I don't know what that does, so I'm not going to take it. We should probably just leave. Yeah. This could be a very short run, and I was anticipating that when we started. Because, you know, it is what it is. It's a, it's a Blue Baby run. And I anticipate Blue Baby runs to be short-lived, because I have scant practice therewith. Uh, the poop is probably not too helpful for us. <laughs> I would like to replace it in, in due course. Mom's knife is going to help a great deal. That's absolutely true. Because of the damage bonus from Mom's knife, it's just going to slaughter things. But I have to not get hit in the process. Or just use Dry Baby, which I probably should have thought of. This is what I was hoping for, a second one. Just to keep us out a little bit more survivable until something good happens, I guess. Maybe we can find a secret room and it'll have uh, Black Lotus. I mean, that's three spirit hearts for us. Well, two spirit hearts and a black heart, I suppose. We just need the most survivable opportunities we can find, really. Uh, I'm not a fan of this, so if you would like to punch right off, thank you. If, oh, how did it hit me? I think I now have two and a half left. One and a half, I mean. I had two, and that would have cost me half the damage, so. <laughs> wow, okay. Whew. We do have a key, and we can go to our item room, which is Blue Baby's only friend. Uh, Tinted Drop, we should check. No. Definitely going to keep a lookout for Tinted Drops, especially with five bombs. They're going to be a no-brainer. It's not even going to be a, a cost-benefit analysis involved. Ah, wow. Dry Baby's really coming through for us. Sort of unexpectedly, because I forget that Dry Baby's there. It's very easy to let Dry Baby sort of hang out at the sidelines. But it can do some really good work for us. If we let it... Oh. Oh, don't die. Unfortunately, it does involve bullets. And us being near bullets. Because it was our first pickup. It's very close to us. Uh, and not in the emotional sense, I suppose. We could possibly think about using Blue Baby's only friend here. Because, uh, Blue Baby. I wonder whether this is a themed run. We've had Blue Baby's only friend as Blue Baby. And two dead items. Oh, we've had a couple of other things. A Tears Upgrade doesn't necessarily help. Well, I would love to take either of these, but unfortunately we can't. So, goodbye those things. Uh, we'll just head down. Boss Rush is basically imperative, but if we make it that far, I'm going to be reasonably pleased. Uh, can't do that yet, but uh, a, a Skeleton Key would be nice. Probably still can't justify spending both keys on the Double Key Room at this stage. That was pretty good. Uh, I will spend a bomb for five cents. Because we didn't have five cents, we had more than enough bombs. There's a bomb back. Uh, I'll open this. It's a boss trap room. I did a lot of damage, and now we can see where we're going, so... I think that was worth doing. That was the sun card I used, by the way. It damages everything on the room. Dry baby again. Can't go wrong. Uh, yeah, sun card damages everything on the room. And shows you the map, which is super sweet. It also gives you full HP. We don't have red HP, so that doesn't help. 
If we can find an Isaac's room, that would also be beneficial to us, because that's three spirit hearts immediately, even if it doesn't have a, a black market or crawl space associated with it. Doing okay, just don't throw it. This is a perfect room to throw on, upon which to throw. Crikey. Right, baby. Perfect timing. Good, 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 good. Right. Jump through here, jump through here. Don't fudge the timing on those things, but hopefully that's not worth anything to me. Apart from you know, horrendous terror. The double key room is a chest room. It's probably not worth the effort. We can't go to the curse room. We have to beat this boss without getting hit too much, so uh, I'm not looking forward to that. I mean, Mom's knife is certainly going to assist with this. I don't know whether it's going to carry us through it. I would very much like more opportunities for spirit hearts. Should we go? I think we should go to the shop afterwards. Oh shit. <laughs> We're going to die We're right here. I can feel it. Just don't fuck it up. We did it. Yes. Uh, that's actually an HP upgrade. It's a spirit heart for us. It's not going to stick around like most things with uh, Blue Baby. It is short for this world. Which is the opposite of long for this world. Do you see? Not long for this world. Short for this world. Plenty of bombs, but no spirit hearts uh, with which to... Sorry, no tinted drops to check. Which is a shame. I very much like them. We should probably check out that secret room as well. We have the bombs. Uh, that was really terrible. <laughs> I did get stuck, but I wasn't aware that I got stuck, and that's the terrible part. I should be uh, more, more receptive to such situations. I nearly did it again. But... I didn't do it again, and I think that's what counts. Ah, uh, we'll take this. Sure, <laughs> let's use it straight away. Um, I basically bought a shitload of bombs for five cents, which is fine with me. We're going to be using a lot of them. I guess we can only get health ups, but then hmm, teleport is probably not helpful. I'm sorely tempted to try these self-sacrifice rooms, but at the same time, I think it may be a horrendously bad idea. Especially with only 2 HP at all. Could go to the curse room. Curse room, screw it. We're very slow, uh, which is unexpected given that we have Mom's knife right now. Uh, no. Do not want mysterious candy. Well, I don't think this does anything for us, but it's a guppy item, which will be our second guppy item, but there was no way we were taking Mom's knife and guppies anything. Can these give us ten spirit hearts? It would be nice. I'm not going to go back to that curse room, that secret room. It's such a slog. We need to get a press on, because if we're going to make it to boss rush, we need to make it to boss rush, right? If we're going to even entertain the possibility, which I am, because, you know, who dares wins. Wow. I kind of wish I'd taken nine lives, because then I would have been able to possibly come back. Oh, it wasn't nine lives, though, was it? It was, um... It was only Guppy's collar, so there was no guarantee of coming back to life. So I think I played, made the right decision, although I would very much like it to have been nine lives. Fortunately, it was not to be. Uh, use Blue Baby's only friend here. It's much easier to hit them with, and I don't need to get close to those random bullet sprays they're so fond of. Is this an Excel floor good, I think? Yes, it is. That's uh, unfortunate. She's lit. See, hiding behind. Uh, ooh. Hiding behind Dry Baby is. Uh, a valuable technique. Let's try and find some black hearts. No black hearts. Envy. No thank you. Let's use um, Blue Baby's only friend again. It is a fly item, I believe, so there's a chance that we get Beelzebub. Previously known as Lord of the Flies. In fact, Beelzebub is Lord of the Flies. That's what it means. Uh, but we used to call it the Lord of the Flies transformation until... For exploding until Yon extension expansion came out, and we all started calling it the Elzebub because it told us what it was called. Jeez, no, it's done. Didn't take Guppy's collar, so there was no chance of winning. Look, that was a bad run. I expected a bad run, so I'm happy that we had the practice with Blue Baby. In fact, I think I'm probably going now to play some Blue Baby runs on my own. Uh, but I really didn't feel it. So few tinted rocks with. Spirit Hearts in. We had one tinted rock and it wasn't even Spirit Hearts. So 
the defensiveness was just not there in that run, and I don't have the uh, technical skills to deal with that. But thank you for watching, and I'll hopefully do better tomorrow, depending on what we get, I suppose. So come back then. <laughs>